Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe. who died last weekend by domestic violence. Aliyah Perez was just 26 years old. TMJ4 Sarah McGrew shows us how those close to her are now using Aliyah's story to encourage others in a similar situation to reach out for help. We're here to celebrate the brightest light. Between tight embraces and grief-filled tears, family and friends came together to remember Aliyah Perez. Beloved daughter, granddaughter, niece, prima hermana. To her uncle, Common Council President Jose Perez, she was also known as Lili. Say, we love you, Lili. Police say Aaliyah was killed on Sunday during a domestic dispute. She was just 26 years old. The suspect later killed himself following a police chase. During the vigil, the family also bringing awareness to domestic violence and encouraging others to seek out resources in our community. We are committed to the community as we feel this tragedy. We want to continue to help anyone in the same space so that this doesn't happen to anyone else. Earlier this week, Council President Perez shared resources in Milwaukee for those experiencing domestic violence, including the UMOS Latina Resource Center Crisis Line, Milwaukee Child Protective Services, Sojourner Family Peace Center, and the Milwaukee Women's Center. I just want all of us to think of all the positive things, and I know what Lily would want us to do is to carry on and to be that light that she was for us, for everyone else. In a post on Facebook, a sister of Aaliyah said that Aaliyah was filled with love and smiles. Reporting in Milwaukee, Sarah McGrew, TMJ4 News. All right, Sarah, thanks. We will have that list of resources again in this story on TMJ4.com. According to the National Coalition Against Domestic Violence, one in three women and one in four men have experienced some form of physical violence by an intimate Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.